welcome folks! I'm golfing with my school team up on my home course in about an hour and I have absolutely no balls. I lost all my Wilson balls that I just did a review on so I'm going to get a new three-piece ball that I haven't played before. I am improving. I, I feel that I'm improving a lot more so I'm going to step up my ball so I can so it, so it fits my game a bit better. So I'm not going to tell you what kind of ball it is because you're going to find out in just a hot second. So I'm going to head over to Golf Town and you're going to see what kind of ball it is. So three, two, one. I got the TaylorMade Rocket Balls Urethane, the three piece urethane ones. So I'm really excited to try these out and obviously I'm going to do a review on them once I've lost all of them because you eventually will lose all your balls. Yeah, so let's go ahead and unbox them and see what's inside. So there they are. A really nice looking box. TaylorMade always does a really good job on their packaging. So let's open it up. All right. Um, yeah, really impressive job with the packaging. Alcohol's urethane. So I'm gonna open these up because I can't do it with one. Well, actually, I can. Let's let's just let's test my manhood. So I saw these when I was working, because because um, when I work, when I wash the carts, you always find balls, sleeves of balls that people leave in their carts, so I found these in there. So I'm like, okay, well, why don't I go buy some and try it out? I, um, I wasn't able to take the sleeve of balls home with me, so uh, I'm going to uh, zoom in and uh, get a closer look at these. So here it is up close. Looks really good. It smells really weird too. Like when I open up the package, it's not like I was opening up a package of markers. All right, so I've unboxed them. I've showed you them. I hope. Um, oops. So pretty much, I'm just gonna mark these because, like, just put a line like right here where it says RBC urethane or yeah RBC urethane on it, just so it's easier to line my putts. And yeah, I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna head up to the golf course. This is the view from the top of the 11th. Absolutely beautiful.
Check out those clouds. Freaking amazing. That's awesome. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed the footage. I know there wasn't a lot of it, just a couple swings here and there. That's mainly because I don't have a proper stand for my iPhone. And once I get a proper stand, I can screw it onto my, to my tripod. And I'll be able to upload much better videos for you guys. I shot a 99, which isn't good. I got three parts in a row though, which was alright. But I could have played a lot better. My lowest round there is a 92, which is very good because that course is extremely tough. You could... Um, hit your ball to the left or to the right and it could still be in play but you might not find it because there's there's hills all over the place so hopefully I'm gonna I'm gonna play again uh, next week probably next Saturday and I will hopefully break 90 I want, I want to be able to shoot 80 on that course or in the 80s whether it's mid 80s low 80s or high 80s if I can get into the 80s on that course I'll be very happy now I have been uploading a lot of range videos and a lot of course vlogs, so you have, if you have any video suggestions on something different that I should do, whether it's a tips and tricks video, or an on-course how-to video, anything different that I don't do a lot, let me know in the comment section down below. Personal message me or let me know on Facebook because that will be absolutely awesome because I want to start uploading a more variety of videos. Make sure you like on Facebook. Make sure, honestly, make sure you like on Facebook. Uh, there's a video. I mean, there's a link in the, in the, in the description of this video. So make sure you like on Facebook, and yeah, I'll see you next Friday. And have an awesome night or day. Well, it depends on where you're watching this. Anyway, peace out, home doughy boy.